Hey weirdos, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel for those of you that are new here and if you're new here, my name is Lindsay. I upload videos every week and today I'm going to be unboxing my fall FabFitFun box. I have a few other older FabFitFun videos if you guys want to go check that out. And before we get started, first of all, how are you guys? Happy fall. It's officially fall. Bring out the flannel, bring out the fuzzy blankets, the sweaters, the cute boots. Fall is my prime. Anyone else? What's your favorite season? I want to know. I feel like most people are in love with fall, but then you have those like summer lovers and I'm like, why? <laughs> so before we get started, the last couple of years, I think the last two years or so, I really like to support this candle company called J&L Candles. And I have two of their candles that I bought and I still haven't gone through them, that's why. But I do want to get more of their candles. This is pumpkin pie. I have this in the background. Oh, the scent is super strong and they are a black owned, small owned business. And then I also have pomegranate, which smells just like pink Starburst. These candles are very affordable. They are handmade, I believe, as well as being an indie brand. You guys should definitely go support and check them out. I love supporting them. And now that it's fall, I can bring it back in the background of my videos like I used to. And I also have to give myself a little pat on the back and a little... A little moment to promote myself. I also make candles um, and yes I like to still support other candle companies even though I make my own candles. I don't see the problem with that and I don't see like you know what I mean. I think it's even cooler because I understand how hard it is. So I have my own Etsy shop and I make natural handmade hand poured soy candles and this I just launched my fall collection. I will put up some pictures now as I'm talking. I have three scents. I have Coffee First, which is vanilla and coffee. I have Hello Fall, which is green apple and cinnamon. I have some Halloween horror film themed wax melts, Nightmare on Elm Street and Hocus Pocus. And then I have this, this is my favorite. This is pumpkin spice and everything nice. Pecan, pumpkin, and a hint of cinnamon. Um, so this is what this candle looks like. It's currently burning right now. They're all double wicked and they, oops, I got a little jaspy hair in there. Oh, it smells so good. I love it. I'm going to put it back over here before I mess it up. And also this is the tops. The tops to these jars are bamboo. My jars are, uh, frosted matte black glass jars um, and yeah this is bamboo and it looks really nice with it. it looks super nice so yeah and I also have my zodiac collection I still have um, lots of leftovers from my zodiac collection which actually my candles from my zodiac collection on my Etsy shop have a surprise inside so as they melt you'll have like this aluminum foil and then you take it out with like tweezers so that you don't burn yourself you let it cool you unwrap it and there's a surprise inside that is zodiac related and it's something that you can wear um so i thought that'd be really cool so i still have some of those they're supposed to be kind of funny um with the sayings on them so i think they're really cute i'll throw up some pictures my etsy link is always in my description but because it's fall i really wanted to take a moment and give some love and promotion to my small business because I work really hard and I know everyone loves fall candles and candles in general. I've really upped my quality. Um, it is it has officially been a year of owning my own small business and there's been lots of trials and errors. Um, I finally have an amazing supplier and I have quality supplies and I have finally really narrowed down my formula and I'm so proud of all the progress I've made. There's definitely been lots of flops and fails and mistakes I've had to learn from but I have learned so much and my business has come so far and I'm so proud with the quality of candles for my fall launch. This is officially my favorite launch ever and it is by far the best quality candles that I have ever made including the Zodiac candles but fall is just my favorite. So anyways I had to throw that on there so I have some fall candles going on in the background. We're in the mood. I've got a fuzzy plaid sweater on so let's get into it. <laughs> a thumbnail but it's just not gonna work because this box is huge so this is my FabFitFun box it is larger than normal because I do believe I added 
think one or two add-ons i don't even remember what they were as you guys know i typically forget what i even picked out for my box because it's been so long Ooh, ooh okay 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 so i did an add-on of you know what i'll i'll wait a second it's it's really cute though you guys are gonna love it let me just get everything out damn they gave me this big ass box <laughs> this big ass box a little dramatic oh i just throw stuff sometimes you know this was my add-on and then we'll get into the actual box so i thought i added on two things but i guess i just added on one honestly that makes more sense because i usually don't even do add-ons in general anyways this i thought was super cute i believe this was only like five or ten dollars to add on and it's this really cute rug so I thought it'd be really nice and I don't know I just really like the vibes of it and the quality is so nice it's like thick and almost like a knitted like feel to it it is really pretty so oh I just love it so much that's so pretty now let's get into the box I'm surprised that this box didn't show up like ruined because as you guys know because I live overseas, every time I get my FabFitFun box, it's like the outside is damaged, which I really don't care because like it's not like anything inside is damaged. Um, but usually there's like tape and it's dented, so this is in perfect condition. Oh, it's so cute. It has leaves on it. That is so cute. Wow, okay. Oh, you always get this FabFitFun catalog. Oh, let's not. Let's not like tip over my tripod <laughs> so you always get this fabfitfun catalog it talks about um the brand and usually oh yeah it tells you how much everything is worth so as i always do this as i talk i will edit this video and put the price of these items on the screen and at the end I will put how much the box was worth and how much I spent which each box is $50 per season so it's $200 a year. It's an amazing deal. Not sponsored by the way but I think FabFitFun is such a fun gift to yourself. It literally feels like Christmas, birthday kind of vibes and it's nice because you're not paying for something every month. It's literally just $50 once per season so there's four seasons 200 a year and you can pay in advance if you want to i just think fabfitfun is brilliant so they're really nice they give you like 15 off your first fabfitfun box so this is something that you can gift to a friend so i will see if anyone wants that Ooh, okay 60 dollar credit discover wine you love this would be really nice for like an anniversary or even to gift to somebody that i know always get a hello fresh 16 free meals including free shipping oh this is a healthy box i think i got this last time Ooh, okay so the first thing that i pulled out from the box is guardian angel revitalizing eye gels what i do brighten hydrate and depuff Hero ingredients, cucumber, rose, rose extract, green tea, hyaluronic acid, ideal for tired and overworked eyes, jet lag, and pre-party prep. Four individually wrapped masks. I'm so excited to use these. I have a bunch of face masks, and I think I have some eye masks, but I have a lot of face masks that I really need to start using uh i need to do more face mask nights for myself because my eyes need this my i have bags under my eyes i've had them since middle school and they go like this and when i post like up close pictures of my face and like my makeup it always looks like my makeup skips right here or is like messed up or something because i have huge bags i've had for years and i just yeah they're there for life they're there they're there for the rest of my life probably <laughs> What is this? It says after dinner food drink. And by the way, it doesn't cost anything to customize your box. It only costs you. Um, the only thing that costs you is if you add on stuff, but it doesn't cost you to customize like I think three or five of your items. I don't know. This is so cute. I thought this would be so cute for Aaron and I or like when we're hanging out with friends. Why? It's a little like conversation game. It says 120 food and drink questions. But I thought these would be cute for like having friends over. I would say family, but we don't live close to 
anybody from home. <laughs> we live in another country. Which state is the number one dairy producer in the U.S.? By the way, the answer is California. Wow. Um, generating around one-fifth of all U.S. milk. Okay, then we have Dose & Co. Pure Collagen Unflavored Collagen Peptides. What is this? Sustainable packaging types 1 and 3 collagen, natural ingredients, gluten-free. Yeah, but like, am I dumb? I don't know. Oh, it's protein. Wow, I feel stupid. Don't make fun of me. I didn't know what it was. Okay, I don't use this stuff. Natural protein supports smooth skin and strong hair and nails. Honestly, I'm not really into stuff like this, so I'm not... I'm not mad about it, but I'm not super excited because I personally am just not into the whole protein powder uh stuff like this i don't know i'm just like not but it's it'll, it'll you know i'm not mad about it it'll be something to try out okay Ooh, what is this oh wait oh my gosh they threw in this cute little thing this cute little lip balm they threw in dr rogers restore lip balm that is super cute my lips do get very very dry i mean all year round living here in england the water is harsh the air is pretty dry um but winters here are super dry on top of you know the harsh water so i mean i'm not gonna be mad about them throwing in a little chapstick because i have so many chapsticks that i just keep in my car my purse my vanity don't worry guys, we're doing the small stuff first. I like to do the big stuff for last. Make you guys wait. <laughs> okay, this is lunch pack. Pack rolls down and closes neatly. Roll to the back, strap over the front. Ideal for taking meals on the go, storing food, filling bulk grains, and coffee or handfuls of snacks, okay? So like what? Oh, okay, wow, it's bigger than I thought, what? This is cool. Okay, I love, wow. <gasps> that is so cool. I'm. This is how I know I'm about to turn 25. Guys, I turned 25 soon. I started this channel when I was 20. Oh my God, I was 20 years old. I'm about to turn 25 in March. I know, you're like, oh, you're such an Aries. It's far away. But look, that is so, I love getting really convenient travel things like this that save space or that are really good for like the earth and sustainable because, um, at least that's what it says at least. Because Aaron and I, of course, pre-COVID, I mean, we've traveled a tiny bit um, since everything, but living in England, we are traveling a lot. So it's really nice to have stuff like this. So this would be really nice to have, whether you're on the airplane or in a car ride. So I actually really, really like this. And I'm going to put this with like travel stuff. Okay, this was customized. I did customize this. Uh, I don't know if it's going to look good. <laughs> So I did customize this, but like when you customize, they give you like different options. So like I had to pick between this and other things. It's cute. I just don't know if like I'll look good in it. <laughs> Everyone's like, take it off now. Okay, let me see. I don't know if I'm going to look cute in it. I do have a big head, but I need to tighten it a little more. Oh, that's too tight. I got a dome, man. I got a dome. If I don't like how I look in it, I'm going to wrap it up and give it to my sister Meredith as a gift because she likes wearing hats and she actually like can pull them off and like, I don't know. I don't know, Chief. I don't know. When I used to wear caps, I would wear them backwards. I look really good in backwards hats, but like I can't pull off like, I don't know. I think I'm just going to gift this to my sister Meredith, but this is the thing that I like with FabFitFun. If I ever get anything that's just not really for me or doesn't look good on me like I thought it would or I don't like it or I don't need it, I always save it and I make like a pile in my house and then like I can give it to people as gifts like for birthdays or Christmas. Um, I think that's amazing to like pay something forward. So I'm actually going to give this to my sister. I think she would really like this. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> this is a big item and I am so excited for this. Oh my goodness. I customized this. This was not an add-on, so this didn't cost me anything. Um, but this is a waffle blanket. I can't pronounce the brand. Oh my gosh. It is a really pretty fall blanket. Look at that. Ah! Uh, I can't wait to put this in our living room and like Okay, hold on, hold on. Oh my gosh, it's so big. It's not like a little throw blanket. This is nice. 
Oh, this is like a nice one person blanket, but it's definitely not small like a throw blanket. That's pretty wide. See here and then here. That's pretty wide. And it's really long too, like here and then here. You can kind of get an idea. And this is like the material. It's that waffle textured feel. Uh, it's not my favorite feel for a blanket, but it definitely is nice and thick. This blanket is very thick and the quality is really nice this is something that too we would keep in the house but if we traveled during the fall and winter when it's more cold and chilly I would probably bring this in the car with me because it's going to keep me nice and warm because it is super thick so I really like this also green is my favorite color so I freaking love the color so much that is so perfect for fall it's it's green and it's a blanket like what more could I ask for you know this is the last item I don't fully know what this is, so let's see. Oh, wait, I did. Okay, it said... Oh, I, I, I misread it. Okay, so this is a wood cheese board. I can't pronounce the brand, but there you go if you're interested. <laughs> I'm this, I know I'm aging, guys. I'm aging. So this is really nice. It's thick. This feels like really, really, really nice wood. It feels really nice. I love cheese boards because when we have people over, I'll put like crackers, cheese, grapes, clementines, some chocolates, um, pepperoni, some carrots and ranch dip, you know, like celery and peanut butter. I'll put stuff like that out. And sometimes I even do that for Aaron and I. And yes, I have made these boards for myself, like a snack board. Okay, guys, so that is it. I got seven items from this FabFitFun box and then I did add on one item and then I got four, I think four coupons. And yeah, that's about it guys. So I got seven items. This is the final price and how much it's worth and how much I paid. So typically each box that you get is worth like 150, I believe minimum, but I've gotten boxes that are worth like 300. So thank you weirdo so much for watching. Happy fall. I'm super excited. I can't wait to go apple picking. Erin and I are going apple picking tomorrow, which is Sunday um, with one of our friends. I might vlog it. I might not, but I will definitely take pictures for Instagram if you guys want to follow me on there. I like everything that I got in this box, but I am a little disappointed because I don't know. I was expecting like a little different. Like my first fall box, I got like really cute fall themed things that just seemed more fall. But you know what? That's okay. I do like my box. I am excited. I'm going to use a lot of this stuff. So I'm kind of feeling like mutual on it like neutral is that it yeah i'm feeling like neutral i like my box i don't love it but i don't dislike it but obviously i like the things i customized maybe next time i'll try not to customize it and like it'll be more of a surprise i love you weirdo so much thank you for loving me and supporting me and everything that i do and i will see you guys in my next video and make sure to stay weird stay kind hey what was this what was this stay weird stay kind and of course stay safe Bye.